everyone welcome back to my channel hope you are doing great and firstly i would like to thank everyone for your so good response on my rangoli designs and if you haven't watched any of them yet then quickly click on the icon somewhere on the screen or i'll also mention the link in the description box this video i have come up with something a diy project i'm going to make some art some kind of painting using the clay art on the cake bowl if you don't have the cake bowl at your home you can also buy it separately it's available in the market for rupees 10 so without wasting any of our time let's head to the process and before that let me remind you if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then don't forget to hit the subscribe button also give back your suggestions any ideas any feedbacks in the comment section so yeah now let's head to the process so let's have a look upon the requirements. So basically the cake would contain the soup two sides, uh, the glossy and the matte one. So we are going to use the matte side because it will help the pencil to stick to its surface properly. So here I'm going to draw some uneven curvy lines. Uh, so this is basically going to act like a base while pasting the emcel on the cake board. So now my drawing is ready. The next step is to take emcel and you are going to mix the two emcel together uh, using the talcum powder which gives a smoother finish. Then we are going to roll it into the desired shape. So here we are going to do uh, two steps. First I am going to flatten out the entire emcel and then I am going to press the two ends so it forms a peak at the center and also gives a very realistic look from the side way. So we are going to repeat the same step for the rest of the object which we have made on the cake board. So once everything is done, you have to keep it aside for about 4 to 5 hours so that the emcel gets dry up completely. So after 4 5 hours, the emcel is enough hard. So let's begin with the process of painting. So here I am making use of acrylic colors. So I make so I am using the poly range from it. So I mentioned the exact shade name the down in the description box so do check out so using the first color i'm going to cover the half of the cake board excluding the emcel part as you can see i'm just dabbing the color so it gives out the effect of rough texture So now using the second shade which is one shade lighter than the previous one we are going to cover the rest of the cake board of course excluding the emcel part. So this two combination gives a very uh, nice ombre effect so you can use any combination of your, your choice. So for the emcel part I am going to cover it up with the yellow color. So once everything is ready, it's time to conceal the glitches, if any. So for a finishing effect, we are going to make 
a black border around three four part of our cake board and yes our painting is now done one more thing guys next time when you are buying a cake eat up all the cake but don't throw away this cake board because it can be reused in various ways and one of the ways i've already shown in this video so if you like it so then don't forget to give a big thumbs up and do subscribe so yeah see you next time till then take care thanks for watching